What if I told you that you could create a fully functional Android app, add payment integrations, enable email verification and deploy everything in minutes without writing a single line of code. In this video, I will show you exactly how to build your first mobile app from scratch. First you need is a good prompt. I wrote a clear prompt for a modern easy to use expense tracker that lists all the features for our MVP you can generate using ChatGPT here. Now you just need to copy this prompt and go to go back to our tool that we are going to use today that is rocket.new. It's basically a no code builder that where you can build mobile apps, internal tools, website, dashboard, landing page and lot more. Even you can import your design from Figma here. So it support like almost all framework out there such as Flutter, Next.js, React and all of them. It has loads of integrations like GitHub, Superbase, Figma, Netlify, Stripe and everything that you want. So now what we will do is we will just copy the prompt that ChatGPT generated for us and paste in the rocket prompt box. So we will just go to our ChatGPT here and copy this prompt. You can see this is our prompt. We will just copy it and now we will paste into the rocket prompt, uh, rocket prompt box. We will just paste this here. You can even upload UI reference if you have in mind. If not, just click on the send button right here. It will take some time to analyze your prompt. Now you can see it says I will build a complete expense tracker mobile app using Flutter. This will include all the features we requested. This app initially will front end only after creation we can integrate Superbase. Now it asks us to select the screen we want in our website. We can just select all of them. If you don't want any feature just don't click on it. If you want all of them just select all then click on build my mobile app button right here. And the token consumption is also related to the number of screens you selected. So currently we selected 8 screen. Now it says working on our request. So it will start writing code for each of the screens that we selected. You can see it started to write our code here. We can see all the codes. Now it says switching to preview. So now here you can see it says I will take around 20 to 25 minutes to build as per our request. I will build well researched, well designed and well written and functional solutions each time. So it's gonna take around 20 to 25 minutes to build our complete MVP or first initial version of our app. Once it's ready, I will show you how our apps looks like. So just wait for it. So as you can see here, it says our app is completely ready. Created an expense tracker app with splash screen, dashboard, transaction management and budget tracking features. Even added UI with animation, swipe gestures and the pull to refresh and the bottom navigations, added reports and interactive charts, data exports, setting management and the financial insights. Here are the all files of our app which is created in a flutter obviously and you can edit any of these if you want. So now let's see our app is if our app is live or not so it's still loading i think uh, it's waiting for the let's wait for the preview right here so right now we can see the initial version of our app you can see the main screen here it's like loading bar here and now you can see this is our main dashboard here here we can see total income recent transactions good afternoon oh, and we can even change the theme to light or dark maybe and here we can add transact view all transaction and even add transaction by clicking on this plus button right here and we will just click on add transaction and we, here we can add income and expense so it's like pretty good even we can add income here so it is like very helpful for us so we will just add coffee in expense and an amount let's say add five us dollars and in, we will now select the category here so i will just select food here there are a lot of category and then click on save transaction so now you can see here it's like a blank i think there might be some error in it so we need to fix that I think it might be the error from the super base because we haven't even integrated the backend yet so that my this is why the error is coming so what we will do is we will just say to add the super base in our app so it can save all our data and we can even add the sign up and login process into the app so now if you want to add any features or like you want to add super base or database just go to the prompt box here and write whatever you want to add like now i will say please add super base here and then send it so now you can see here it started to uh, like processing our request and now it says we need to connect our project to superbase for that here just click on select a project and click on create new superbase project and give it a name like uh, we can just name it to x and uh, in the database password create you can create a strong password and click on create new project button now it will create a new superbase project for you and it will automatically connect it to it now you just need to wait for about few seconds then you can push this project to superbase so we will just wait here for a few seconds and now you can see here our almost everything is ready we will just click on push to superbase so now you can see that this version of app also gives us option to login using a demo account if you click on the use demo account button it will automatically fill the demo credentials for you however for our testing we need to focus on something connecting with superbase the first step is to refresh the app then go with the 
normal sign up process here you just click on the sign up and fill the basic detail like email i am entering demo at the demo app and just for testing for the password you can simply create a demo password since this is only test to super base integration then enter the same password in the again and now make sure you take this uh, i agree to terms and conditions then click on sign up now you will see this sends a message that account created successfully please check your email this indicate uh, this indicates that superbase is connected and handling authentication correctly but let's check in our superbase here for that just go to superbase and click on authentication and you will find all the users list here that means the integration is working now to properly test the email verification flow we will need to sign up with a real email address so let's go back to the app and once we click on the sign up here we fill all the real credentials now the test of rest process is the same just create a password re-enter password confirm password box agree to terms and create your account so now let me enter my uh, password first so this time we are entering our real email so that we can test our email verification flow so now we will just enter the confirm password click on the box and we will click on create account here now as you can see here you will again see the message account created successfully please check your email and now you should see a verification email from superbase so now we will just open our email and refresh it and you can see here this is our email verification just click on confirm email now our email is confirmed when we enter our credentials in a login page now let me enter my email first here and now i will enter my password along with the email to log in my account so we logged into our account successfully right away we can see the details such as recent transaction total income if you compare this with the earlier version of app you will see a notice that before app used to show a bunch of preloaded transaction but since we are connected with it superbase it only shows the transaction we add now let's add an income transaction from here we will fill the some basic info and like such as amount and the title and we can select category and click on add transaction immediately you will see a new income added to the list and the total income value will be updated as well from here you can manage all the records delete transaction for example we can see here the reports and analytics and we can do anything we want that we have all the features that we requested this app also has a report section as i showed you along with the setting panel that gives us control over various features from here we can view the old transaction which is the total data or configure the app in different phase now let's try adding an expense here just click on the expense let's try an amount uh, entry for some let's say add a coffee and we will just select the food from here and click on the save transaction and just like that the five dollars coffee expense shows up instantly in the app is reflected in the transaction list in the total too so this confirms that our superbase is integration is fully functional if you want to adjust the email verification system in the superbase let me show you how you can do that too so for that you just need to go to superbase and in the authentication uh, in the setting panel you will see this page just click on uh, sign in and providers and you will find this page now here you just need to click on the confirm in email option and just turn this off and click on save changes now it will not send you the confirmation mail and directly user can create account with it so we also provide many customizable options for example you can configure how email are sent change templates or adjust authentication rules so finally let's talk about publishing the app if you want to test it in your phone just click on install on the phone button side the app builder here then click on the install and choose the build app now it will uh, generate the complete apk file for your app this usually takes around 30 to 40 seconds and it can take up to a minute and once it's completed your apk will be ready and downloaded and the link of the apk file will be sent to your email and we can test it so now we will just wait for it to build our apk file then i will test it in my phone then i will show you so meanwhile our app is building let's take a look at the different integrations available such it has like gemini open ai stripe for payments perplexity along with the many other messaging provider tools all of these can be set up directly from this panel you just need to add your api key and the integration will be active since we already connected our app with the superbase the database side is fully handled now let's take a look if we want to get more tokens or more integration such as netlify how we can do that for that you just need to simply click on the tokens button right here and you will find the pricing plans and the integrations button we will just click on the integration and we have netlify integrations if you want your website to publish on local i mean the subdomains so you can just enable the netlify here and you can publish your app using netlify we have other uh, integrations such as github and google analytics you can enable that too so currently we are in the free plan if you want to buy the plans to get more tokens we have lots of plans here such as 20 us dollars 40 us dollars and the 80 us dollars the major difference here is about the token if you buy the 20 dollars plan you will get 5 million tokens and if you buy the 40 dollars plan you will get the 10.5 million tokens and the most details uh, remain same like project or private data will not used 
and then the $80 plan you will get 22 million token this is like for the annual plan if you want to buy the monthly just click on monthly it's like $25 per month for the 5 million tokens and the rest of details uh, remain same now what you will get is 6 figma screen to code conversion and if you want to read more details i will add the link of the pricing in the description box so you can check it out now let's take a look at our app if our app is ready to download and we can test on our android device so now our app is ready to download we receive the apk download link in our email just click on the link and download the apk file since i am on computer i will open using blue stacks but if you are on the mobile you can simply download and install directly to your phone by following the same steps here you can see the app we built with rocket builder it's fully functional i even tested it by adding a simple three dollars expense everything is working perfectly and the apps run even smoother on a mobile device in this video i showed you the entire process how to create your app add or remove email verification test your app and finally you can download it with the all integration if you have still any questions or doubt in your mind let me know in the comments i will do my best to help you thank you so much for watching and i will see you in the next one